What this trial does allows us to know the fact that with confidence we can work together with the Malaysian Armed Forces to embark their vehicles and personnel in the event that we have to come together as a team to respond to a future HADR response. I saw two key outcomes that were achieved today. One was interoperability between the Malaysian Armed Forces and the Australian Defence Force and LHD, which is a big success, so we've got the confidence to move forward for future operations. And secondly was the opportunity to conduct that tour of the LHD, so the Malaysian Armed Forces had the opportunity to understand what the capability of the LHD can bring to bear. The, the facility uh, on board of this ship is just uh, superb, and uh, having said that, uh, this region uh, uh, have seen uh, for the last decade that uh, a lot of uh, disaster and the need of uh, humanitarian assistance for disaster relief. Smart questions have been asked by the Malaysians to show, you know, they're definitely keen and interested in the amphibious capability and it's something that I know that they're developing. So I know as a country, the two countries are looking forward to working together to respond to regional responses.